Hi folks, Max from GalaxyS4Root.com. I'm going to show you how to install um, the twerp recovery on any rooted Galaxy S4 uh, using a Goo Manager app. So go ahead and download Goo Manager app and you'll need a rooted phone. And also, this does work on uh, lock bootloaders with AT&T Galaxy S4 and Verizon Galaxy S4. You just need to go root it. I have rooting instructions on my site for uh, AT&T and Verizon Galaxy S4. Go ahead and root it first. Once you have a rooted phone, you can simply go to uh, Goo Manager here. Go ahead and click on Menu and Install Open Recovery Script. Say yes. And double check your model number is uh, matching. The device name for AT&T Galaxy S4, which I have, is JFLTEATT.IMG. Um, you know, so make sure it matches your Galaxy S4. Um, you you should be able to look at the last three letters and see uh, if it matches. Like GTI 9505, I think is like XXS. Um, I forget what the GTI 9500 is, uh, but you should be able to just Google it if you don't know what it is, um, and go ahead and say yes. And this will download the uh, twerp recovery for your Galaxy uh, S4. And also works for most Android devices. You can use this method on any rooted Android device to um, install twerp pretty much. Uh, most phones are supported. Some phones you might have to be careful like uh, S2, some of the S2 because the kernel is part of the recovery. Um, but for like Note 2, Galaxy S4 should all work just fine. So let it download. Um, sometimes the server is slow, but it's working just fine now. And uh, it will install. You know, no, no, don't cancel it. Just, just look for the messages um, because it will show show you that it's installing, and make sure it's installed. And it also, it might ask you for root permissions. So make sure you're watching it and make sure you hit grant or allow if the super user window pops up. It is almost done here. Um, it's lagging a little bit here. So let me go ahead and fast forward. Hold on. For some reason, my phone decided to switch uh, wireless network. So that's why it froze on me. So I download it again. Um, let it do it. Super user granted. Recovery has been installed. Once you see that, you should be all good to go. Reboot recovery. Say yes and go manager and and you should be in twerp recovery yes and this works on most of the galaxy it should work on most of the galaxy s force i think it actually works on all the galaxy s force us cellular um metro pcs even or cricket there you go so you got twerp um i have instructions on how to back up and restore rom using twerp oh do i Maybe I not, uh, but very easy to do. just go ahead and back up. And also, I do have ins uh, ROM installation instructions up there. I'll check the FAQ. Uh, but you do have choice between Twerp or Clock Remote Recovery. They both do the same thing. Some people prefer the touchscreen um, Twerp. This is also, you know, slightly different. So like this one allows you to mount um, more options like USB OTG. I can go ahead and grab my flash drive and connect it as disk drive, which is kind of cool. Um, stuff like that, and also you can mount your internal storage as uh, USB storage if you want, connect it to your computer. That's nice. And, uh, you know, some people prefer Clock Remote Recovery because that one you can use ROM Manager to kind of automate the installation process. Both have advantages and disadvantages, um, but my, fi my current favorite, well, I like both. So, anyway, that was how to install Twerp Recovery on your Galaxy S4. As always, if you like this video, don't forget to hit that like button here, subscribe button down there, and if you have a Galaxy S4, don't forget to sign up for my email list at galaxyS4root.com. We update you once a week with Romulo Week tips, hacks, and more, and I'll see you guys soon. Stay high on Android.